exploring, understanding, and celebrating the natural world of the San Francisco Bay Area. Bay Nature on the Air. I love to watch condors fly. There's just no other bird like a condor. They're very distinctive, just the sheer size, the steadiness of their flight, the colorations under their wings. There's just nothing like them. For roughly the last 200 years, the California condor has, has suffered from shooting, poisoning, habit, habitat degradation. In 82, the population got to its lowest, only 22 individuals. At that time, there was really no other choice but to bring all of those remaining birds into captivity to begin a captive breeding effort so that we could release their offspring back into the wild. Ventana Wildlife Society is the only nonprofit in California releasing California condors. Uh, we manage a site here in Big Sur, as well as co-manage a release site at Pinnacles National Monument with the National Park Service. I know everybody's excited about seeing these birds be released. I know I am. One of the main things that we do is provide education and outreach about wildlife conservation. We have public releases where we invite the public to come and get a glimpse of a condor being released and watch it take its first flight in the wild. The, the pen that you see behind me up on the ridge where the birds will be released is a 25 by 45 foot flight pen. After putting radio transmitters on them, we release them and learn as much as we can about how they're interacting with their environment. Our biologists track the birds using more conventional radio telemetry. Global positioning units, or GPS, are actually put on a few of these condors that can track the whereabouts of the birds so we can gain a better understanding of how well the birds are doing and how well we can plan for the future of the recovery of this bird. Thanks to the successful captive breeding and subsequent release programs such as ours, we now have over 300 condors alive today.